Hi friends! Welcome back to another Sims gameplay channel. I'm so excited to be back with Reese today because the last time we were with her, she completed the fabulously wealthy aspiration. She had already reached level 10 and became an internet superstar of her career, so I'm ready to quit this career. It's kind of annoying and I'm ready to switch her aspiration. I definitely want her to be deviant, so I was already kind of looking at it a little bit. I'm doing Chief of Mischief for the Not So Berry Challenge right now, so I'm inclined to just do Public Enemy. And then as I was looking at it, I think the Public Enemy is right up Reese's alley anyway. It's all about getting in fights and having people be your enemies and stuff, so I think that's perfect. I'm gonna go ahead and choose that one. She's already disliked by two sims, so that's perfect. She's got to perform 10 mean or mischievous interactions. She also has to do that for the internet superstar job. So maybe I'll just keep that for one more day, but I'm definitely ready to quit that thing and find another job. But let's get this going real quick here. Maybe see if we can get these mean or mischievous actions done. I'm gonna let her stream for a minute and see what kind of mean things we can get into. There's somebody out here, so I'm gonna go and do kind of a friendly introduction just to get in there. And then let's be mischievous. I don't really wanna be mean. All right, that's two. <laughs> oh, he's over it. Oh, you're coming into my house. What are you doing? What are you doing? Here, we'll say some nice things with a little bit of a funny story. He doesn't like her one bit. Go ahead and lie about your career. Invite him to a fake party. And then I think the Noxious Cloud is a fart. Share a conspiracy theory. And then Noxious Cloud him. And then I feel like he's gonna go. He's not enthused. <laughs> Alright, what's this Noxious Cloud gonna be? It is a fart. And look, it's a little music note. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why that was so funny to me, but it really was. Oh, and then scare him. Why do I get fame for scaring somebody? I'm a global superstar. Which reminds me, I also think she needs to move at some point. This little apartment is no good for a global superstar. I think my girl needs a penthouse suite. Oh, they had a little hug? Why? And she only needs one more mischievous thing. I'm doing it on this guy. And then we'll noxious cloud him too, just because that's really funny. <laughs> <laughs> that cracks me up. Alright, milestone's complete. Okay, so now in the second level here, she already is disliked by four sims. She's already an adult. And now she has to join the criminal career. So let's get let's get it going. Quit your job. Get this guy out of here. Send him home. He sucks. Yep, you're quitting your job. And you're gonna join the criminal career. And you're gonna love it. Criminal career. A tough gal. Not every sim wants to play by the rules. That sure is Reese. You can make tons of simoleons and have fun too as an outlaw. Heck yeah. All right, second milestone done. That's awesome. So the next level of, is the criminal mind. She has to have a declared enemy, which I thought she did. Oh, she's just disliked. Oh, I felt like that paparazzi guy was her declared enemy, but then they became a little bit romantical. And then reach level four of the criminal career and get into five fights. Oh, that should be easy. Where's Jasminder? So, for her job. Mischief interactions not started, that's a bunch of crap, because I was totally mischievous to the kid across the hall for like an hour. Whatever. Alright, so it looks like it's going to be more of like a night job. I'm going to, ooh, ooh, here's a dude, here's somebody, let's see. Let's give him um, a funny introduction. He looks like Santa Claus. I want you to invite him to a fake party, and let's see if that gets them the daily task done. Look, that's a raccoon over there. Just started the interactions. Where'd she go? Hey, get out of here, Reese. You have to be be mischievous to the people on your street. 
complain about your problems, share some tips about hanging out, and be mischievous. Come on, Reese. Get with the program. I'm not really sure why, but I have this urge to fight this raccoon. So if this raccoon hangs out for a minute, I might try to fight her. <laughs> Only 75% done. Where's that raccoon? There he is. Or her. I think it might be a girl. I think it's funny that you're in a raccoon outfit and I'd like to say hello to you. And then maybe fight you. Oh, come on. Reese, what are you doing? Oh, you're so ridiculous. Oh, wait, there's another raccoon. Yeah, I was going to come over and wake him up, but that's fine. I'll come over and give him an introduction. Okay, I want you to come over here and be funny at first, and then swoop in with the mischief. I think you should mock his outfit. Even though I think it's really cute, and I would never mock a raccoon outfit. But Reese would. Oh, but go ahead and give him false confidence, too. Oh, you don't like him? That's fine. You're going to fight him here in a second. I have this urge to fight this raccoon. Doesn't really matter who it is. Oh, there's another raccoon. Am I getting ganged up on? Oh, my goodness. Look, I tried talking to you earlier, girl, but you ran away. So I'm going to um, insult both of you. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. There's, like, <laughs> I'm about to get, like, my ASB. Uh, we're going to do a uh, funny introduction, but we're going to be mean to everybody, and we're going to get into fights with all of them. Yeah, your mother is not a raccoon. Your mother is a llama. Oh, yeah, chicken with a ham buzzer. And then you're going to shove this raccoon. And then you're going to insult this one. And you're going to shove this one. Let's see. Uh huh. Look, they're just hanging out, jeering. It's a little peanut gallery. Insult him. Throw a drink at him. That's one of my favorite interactions. Oh, she's got a pee? Oh no, I want you to fight one of these raccoons. Why didn't you throw a drink? No, 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 no. Don't leave, don't leave, don't leave. I'm gonna throw a drink at you and fight you, at least one of you, before I go. <laughs> <laughs> That's like my favorite thing. Your mother's a llama. Oh, 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 they're fighting anyway. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> fighting a slew of raccoons. <laughs> That's so funny. Did Reese win that? Yeah, she was triumphant. That's right. Um, excuse me. This fight needs to be registered here. Hello. I just got into a freaking fight. Is it because I didn't instigate it? Wait a minute. Hold on. I will fight this person while I have to be. Here, hold on. You know what? If you're going to hang around, I'm going to fight you too. Let's see. It did register. Oh, the, she's got a new quirk. Wait a minute. Just because Reese is famous, everyone seems to think that she's all right with having her personal space invaded. She'll now become tense when Sims who aren't her family members or those that she isn't in a committed relationship make physical contact with her. On the flip side, having her boundaries respected, as rare as that may be, is sure to make her feel confident to take on the day. No touching, refined palate, phone fanatic, and public number. Boo. No, Reese, do not go to sleep on the park bench. You can go home. You're a little bit dramatic. Go home, go to bed, get ready for your work. Hi, Jesminder. I'd like to fight you. Hi, Jesminder, let me shove you. Hi. Hello. Simmering rage. Yeah, whatever. Maybe Jesminder will be her declared enemy. <laughs> <laughs> throw a drink in her face. Oh, she threw a drink in your face? Listen, Reese, throw a drink in her face right now. You do it back. Nothing came out. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that is too funny. Go to work. Yes. All right, Reese. She's tense and needs a vacation. 
She just started working. Reese, shut the front door. You're ridiculous. That's silly. Reesey Kins. You just started working. Who can she be mean to? Oh, there's another raccoon. You wanna fight? Insult her. Yeah, I'm just gonna fight her. Go fight her. Hey, let's fight. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, good. They don't despise each other. That's fine. I'll throw a drink at you. And I'll shove you again. And maybe you'll become my mortal enemy or whatever. Oh, yeah. Declare an enemy. I don't even really know who you are. See ya. I always felt that Jesminder would be my first enemy. But it's okay. You can be my first enemy. You're my enemy. I'll declare Jesmond my enemy too. I just wanted to get that completed. Hello, raccoon. Would you like to fight me? Huh. Oh no. Okay. Let's see. Uh, no, no. Stop. Stop. Don't sleep on the couch. Gosh, you're so dramatic. And I'm gonna speed this up and check in in a bit. She's gonna continue working on this aspiration and her new career. I noticed something. She has over 10,000 reward points, so I'm gonna get her never weary, and that will help out a ton. I'll hang on to those other 1,600 for right now, just in case, but now she'll never get tired, and that's perfect. I wish she could just jeer at them without having to introduce herself first, because I'm gonna make her do a rude introduction. Ooh, maybe she can fight these guys. That raccoon woke up just in time to see you fight. Hey, bitches! <laughs> Even that raccoon's bored with my video. Oh, no, don't fight in front of the child. Go away, child. Go away, child. I'm about to fight these guys. Fight him! Oh, no, that guy's scared. He's leaving. Whatever. Uh, she put him in a headlock. I saw that, Reese. Good job. You want some of this? I want to show off my muscles. Did she lose? Oh, she got beaten up by that guy. She's still going to insult him. And she's still gonna invite him to a fake party. I don't know about this impersonating mermaids thing. Why and why is that mischievous? I don't understand. No, 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 no. I'm about to fight you. No. No. You come right over here and I'm gonna I'm gonna fight you. And I'm gonna insult you. I got I gotta get one more fight in. Stop. I'm I'm poking a fight at you, man. Give him a mean gift. Oh, here's the mean gift. He 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 was stinky. <laughs> Why isn't she gonna fight him? Ask what Emmanuel's problem is, and then fight him. He said, I really don't like you very much right now, just feeling bitter over a few things that I'll get over eventually or not. Well fine, throw a drink at him. And then you're gonna try to fight him, but it's not giving me that option. Oh, well, there we go. Shove. Fight. Oh, and there's another child. Why did the children come by? Oh, he's really hurt by her. Reese does not care. But she's still dazed from being beat up earlier. This might not go well. Oh no, the child is watching. Mm. Yes! Okay, so now all she needs to do is focus on the career. Alright, so she won that fight and she finished that part of the milestone. So that is great. What is she doing? She just came over here and joined a protest. I gave her free will for like a couple seconds and she's out here protesting. What are you protesting? And what skill is she gaining right now? Charisma. Interesting. That's really funny. All right, Reese, you do you, honey. 
All right. Reese's first promotion. And she's talking about being tense from work. Whatever, Reese. Reese has been promoted to Petty Thief. She will now make extra money per hour. She got a bonus. And she got something emblems of espionage. And her next shift is Monday. And now she doesn't need to go to sleep. So I can build her skills. Have her do her mischief overnight. All that kind of stuff. One of her whims is to become angry, and it says to become angry, you click on other sims and do mean interactions. Well, that does not make her angry. That actually makes her confident and, like, kind of happy. I don't know if it makes her playful, but it definitely does not make her angry like an average sim, if that makes sense. Oh my gosh, Fallon is freezing to death. All right, well, come on in, and let's, let's go in. Stop freezing to death, everyone. She has to be mischievous with some people, so let's see who she can be mischievous. Let's see, who's this girl? Let's give her a funny interaction. No, I, stop, why did you walk away? Why does everybody walk away as soon as I start talking to them? Who else can she be mischievous with? Oh, she leveled up to level eight, mischief. She's giving an enchanting introduction. Oh, and now she's level nine, charisma. She's all done with her mischief interactions for today. All right, promotion. She also swiped something, but now she's a ringleader. She got a, a raise. She got a bonus. Duffel of cash. That's probably like a, a decoration. And the pickpocket interaction. Cool. Okay, cool. She still has to do just mischievous stuff. And she has one more level to reach this. I'd be so happy if Reese got to the third level of this aspiration in this session. Okay, I want to see the pickpocket interaction. Here we go. Oh, she got $119. She hugged him. Oh, that's funny. This says a snitch. Reese failed to get the latest shipment. Turns out the police were already waiting at the docks. There must be a snitch in the ring. Will Reese grill everyone to find out who tipped off the cops? Or fire the whole ring and start a new one? Start a new freaking ring. Because snitches get stitches, so I don't feel like anyone's going to tell her anything. Auditions go well. Everyone learns the this, this sample heist choreography quickly. And a few of the essay-style answers on the written test were quite moving. By the end of the day, Reese has cast an all-star new ring. <laughs> That's funny. Oh yeah, she's definitely gonna get a, well, not definitely, but I'm very hopeful that she'll get a freeze tomorrow. Oh, but she has to do her mischief stuff first. Which mask? Crisis. Half the crew wants to wear ski masks to the next heist. Half insists on clown masks. This thug fashion off has come to blows. As ringleader, should Reese get involved and pick a side? Or step aside and stay neutral? Um, I, I feel like she just needs to, I don't know, I feel like she needs to stay neutral, but I think that Reese would get involved. Reese leads an all-out brawl in the name of ski masks. They're timeless, and those clown masks are so last year. The gang agrees, or is scared to disagree, that ski masks are the way to go. Yay! Milestone complete! Now she's the felonious monk. That's so funny. She got a raise and a bonus, and a vintage baseball bat sculpture. Oh, well, isn't that fancy? That is really funny. So now she's on the last level of public enemy after one session. 
I mean, she really did like amazing. Uh, I am a little concerned about this death of a sim situation, and I hope I don't have to like make that happen. I'm totally confident she can reach level eight of the criminal career, and she already has one declared enemy. We've got to declare Jasminder as her second. Um, but anyway, so who knows? We've got we've got plenty of sims to choose from for that last one. So we shall see. Before we go and end this session, which has been so, so successful, I want to move her. She should totally move into a penthouse. She doesn't need neighbors. She doesn't like all that stuff. She doesn't want people around. So I think I've already chosen the penthouse. There's only one that I haven't played in. So, and also I think it suits her pretty well. So, I'm going to have her move right now. Let's go ahead and move household. Here we go. Oh, I'm really excited. And then what we'll do next time is I will either renovate or add some of her things in there too or something like that. The only other penthouse that she can afford, are, well, she can afford this one, but I don't really like that. I don't think it's good for her. So we're going to go here. I've never lived here before. So I'm very excited about this. She can totally afford it. She has plenty of money. And it's just got the great view. It lifts her spirits. I'm thrilled. We're going to purchase it furnished because I actually kind of like it furnished. So we're going to do that. Yay! Reese is moving on up. Oh my gosh. I just love these. Use. I love this apartment. I just, I think it's awesome. I may get her a butler at this point in time since she's a global superstar and she's fabulously wealthy. I mean, who wouldn't? So, like I said, I looked around here already. I think it's perfectly fine as far as decor goes. I don't see anything crazy. The one thing I did see that was a little weird was the bathtub outside. But I think they're kind of thinking about that as like a individual hot tub, maybe? I love the pool. I love the little bar and sitting area down here. I think that's really cool. And then upstairs, I mean, again, nothing to write home about, but nothing terrible. So I'm going to leave it as is for right now. And maybe the next session, like I said, maybe I can jump in here and renovate it a bit. But I am so proud of Reese and she's very happy. She's so excited. So I'm going to go ahead and end it here. So thanks again for stopping by and I will see you in the next video.